Hello everyone and welcome to Weekly Geek News. Happy Valentine's Day weekend. I hope you're enjoying yours. I couldn't be even more pumped for this weekend. Not because of Valentine's Day. I'm hopelessly alone. But what I'm really looking forward to are some movies. And even though we got a bunch of trailers, the Super Bowl for the Ninja Turtles, X-Men Apocalypse, Jason Bourne, and Independence Day Resurgence, what I'm really looking forward to is the new Deadpool movie, which is out this weekend. I couldn't be more enthused. Make sure you check it out as well. It's getting tons of good reviews. Of course, it's rated R, so it's going to be in the spirit of what I really enjoy to that comic. So make sure you check that out, especially if you're a fan of Deadpool. And now moving on to even more comic book goodness, Batman vs. Superman dropped another trailer the other day, and I suspect if you're a comic book fan you've already seen this, but let's just say something about how badass this is. Batman's just whipping ass, taking names, throwing dudes, breaking necks, it's just ridiculous. If you have not seen this, you need to. Make sure that you check that out. And the next thing that I want to show you is a new movie trailer called Mr. Right, and it's featuring Sam Rockwell and Anna Kendrick, and it seems to be sort of a suspense thriller spy comedy type movie with tons of action, albeit not as much action as the Batman flick, but it does look like it might be really cool. So make sure that you check that out, Mr. Right. And now moving on to my favorite news of the week, and I know a lot of people do not like this movie series, but I absolutely love it. Jeepers Creepers is getting a third installment, and we have confirmation here with a poster that is the definite poster of the movie. I couldn't be more excited. I love Jeepers Creepers 1 and 2. Super pumped for this. Make sure that you check out the entire story in the links below. Also in horror, I found a trailer that seems to blend The Exorcist and The Hangover, and as ridiculous as that sounds, it does seem to be quite cool. It's called Ava's Possessions, and although it's on a low budget, it does seem to be quite good, so make sure that you check that out. It could be fantastic. And now finally, finally, finally to the big, big gaming news of the week. And that's the opening cinematic trailer for Dark Souls 3. And I absolutely love Dark Souls 1 and 2. I beat one. I got nerfed in the second one with the update because I was playing a praise. But that's besides the point. Dark Souls 3 is coming. It looks amazing. I think the Dark Souls franchise is the best digital RPG out right now, hands down. So make sure that you check that out, especially if you love Dark Souls or Bloodborne for that matter, because they're made by the same company. And now moving on to my music recommendation of the week. And this week is going to be a little bit different because I have a news story that deals with music and also I have a music recommendation. And the first thing that I'm going to talk about is the news story, which is Les Claypool and Dean Ween of Primus and Ween, respectively, are teaming up with Trey Parker and Matt Stone of South Park in order to produce their own show where they are fishing and taking guests while they're fishing. Sounds ridiculous. I can't wait to see it. Sure, I'd love to see Dean Wayne and, you know, Les Claypool out in a boat fishing, talking to people. It sounds fantastic. Now, the second thing that I want to talk about is this band called Confess, which is an Iranian band that are facing execution in Iran because of them playing metal. Now, the execution charge is because of blasphemy, albeit they have a ton of charges in Iran and they could face execution. And what's even more horrible about this is their music is absolutely fantastic. Make sure that you check that out. You can check out the music as well as the story by looking in the links below. All right, everybody, that does it for this week. Thank you all very much for watching. If you want more weekly geek news, as well as the various other things that I do here on my channel, make sure that you subscribe. Also, hit the like button if you like the video. I also do a gaming channel called Dread Knight, and you can check that out by clicking any of those links over there to your right. And with that being said, thank you all very much for watching again, and I hope to see you again next time.